Okay guys, welcome back once again to DJ Pablo TV. I'm your host Paul, aka DJ Pablo, and it's a Saturday guys, and I got a brand new album review for you guys, so I'm saying? Tonight we're gonna be going over that brand new album from Birdman and Juvenile called Just Another Gangster, guys, and I can tell you straight up, man, I am so excited, guys. I am happy to see Juvenile back on the scene, guys, so I'm saying? And as an OG, man, I can remember when Cash Money appeared on the scene back in the late 90s, man. See what I'm saying? They dropped that single, Harm, huh? back that thing up. It was crazy. Juvie was a man back then, guys. And then he just disappeared for a while, see what I'm saying? But I am happy that he's back, guys. And I am excited, see what I'm saying? And I am just happy to see Cash Money just really flourishing again and really putting out some crazy work, see what I'm saying, guys? And the album, it's hot. I'm going to do the usual. I'm going to break it down for you guys. I'm going to pick my favorites on the album, guys. And we're going to go over the album. Then when I'm done, you know the usual the link will be in the description for you guys to go check it out for yourself so i'm saying and go cop that so i'm saying guys so without further ado let me not waste any more time and let's jump right in so i'm saying now the album it's got 12 tracks on it guys and it starts off with the title track called just another gangster so i'm saying and this track right here is hot guys so i'm saying it's a straight up 90 star cash money the way you remember juvie from og like me you definitely can relate to this and i'm saying guys the minute you start hearing this it takes you back to the origins of when cash money appeared on the scene we were watching bet all day so i'm saying guys and I can remember the feeling I had when I first started seeing them. So I'm saying, guys, it was a nice feel. It was a different feel for hip hop. So I'm saying, you could see that hip hop was turning and creating a new wave. So I'm saying, apart from the stuff with the East Coast, West Coast beef with Pac and Biggie, all of a sudden Cash Money came on the scene. That's like a new flavor of hip hop was just giving birth. So I'm saying, guys, and Juvenile was a man. So I'm saying, the track, as I said, the track's hot. I love it, guys. The title track, Just Another Gangster, one of my favorites on the album. Salute to Juvenile, man. I am so happy to see you back and really holding your post here where you belong. So I'm saying as one of the pioneers of this new era of hip hop, because I truly think that you and Wayne are the ones who really birthed all of these new kids and created this whole new style of hip hop that's flourishing with the new generation. So I'm saying so salute to you. Salute to Birdman, one of my inspirations, man. I remember when I just came to America, I used to listen to a lot of Cash Money songs just to hear Birdman, because Birdman, every time I hear him, Birdman actually inspires you to just get money. And I used to listen to Birdman just flow on different songs as if I'm listening to a motivational speaker because of the fact that he's always talking about getting money and getting money and getting money. So I'm saying, guys, and I kind of drive me to really get myself up and running and try to make money in America starting my new life. So I'm saying, so salute to Birdman, a true inspiration when it comes to making money. So I'm saying, then we get to track two now, track two right here, guys. One of my favorites on the album, I think this song's gonna be a major headliner, so I'm saying it's called Broke, a straight up bang around here, so I'm saying guys, and with this song, I can straight up declare that Cash Money is back, Juvenile is back, and it's gonna be a nice summer, so I'm saying guys, because the music is gonna be played for a long time, and I'm so excited, so I'm saying once again, to see a Juvie back on the scene, so I'm saying guys, and we're getting some classic Cash Money fire tracks right here, so I'm saying? So it's a straight up banger, it's called Broke. I know if there's a video for it being made, and I can't wait to see it, so I'm saying, guys? This right here is definitely gonna do well. It's gonna do some major stream for Juvenile, and really introduce them to the new generation of kids that are out right now, so I'm saying, guys? So this is definitely one of my favorites on the album, and straight up, headline this is gonna do real well, putting some crazy numbers on the board for Birdman and Juvenile and the whole cash money movement, so I'm saying? Then we get to track three. This one's called Back Then, so I'm saying, guys. This one right here, not a hot track on the album, so I'm saying, guys. And the parts on this, Birdman on it, guys. Once again, as I said, Birdman's a person that inspires me. Every time I hear him, he just inspires me to work harder and try to get money, so I'm saying, guys. And I am proud of Birdman. I like listening to his songs, even though he doesn't consider himself a rapper. But trust me, every time he's on a song, guys, it really plays a major role in my life. I like hearing him and it really inspires me to just hustle and get money. So I'm saying guys, every time I hear Birdman just flow on any song and just kick a verse, so I'm saying. So this one right here, it's called Back Then. I love it, another hot track on the album, so I'm saying. Then we get to track four. This one's called Filthy Money, guys. This one right here, another favorite of mine on the album. And this one is definitely gonna be a headliner as well, so I'm saying guys, this one's real hot. So I'm saying guys, this is something for the street right here. And I can tell you, Juvie killed it on this. He went in, give it that real juvenile raspy type flow, so I'm saying guys, 
and he's really dropping that New Orleans style as well. It goes real nice on this, as I said, classic cash money, classic juvenile right here. And if you're an OG and you're an old juvenile fan, you're definitely gonna be excited when you hear this song as well, so I'm saying. Then we get to track five. Track five is called Breeze, guys. Another hot song again on the album, so I'm saying. Once again, Juvie goes in, Birdman goes in, real nice. And they just give us that real cash money flavor that we've been missing for so long, so I'm saying. Then we get to track six. This one's called From the Block, so I'm saying, guys. This one, another favorite on the album for me. And this one's definitely gonna be a headliner, so I'm saying, guys. This one right here. Real hot, salute to the producer on this as well. And this one right here is another banger that's really representing that old 90s type cash money with Juvie as the headliner. So, I'm saying, guys, I love it. This one right here got me so excited. I had this one repeat a couple of times. So, I'm saying, guys, because I really wanted to just really give that moment when they just came on the scene. I know I felt us watching them on BET all day, every day. So, I'm saying, guys, then we get to track seven. No, track seven is called newly exposed guys and i'm saying not a hot sang on the album so i'm saying guys this one right here a real street banger one of my favorites on the album i love it so i'm saying once again juvie goes in real crazy on this and salute to birdman so i'm saying guys a real hot project i love it so far i'm enjoying it and i'm a true big fan of them man so i'm saying so i can relate to their music and i'm just excited to see them making amends on all the differences and it's coming back together and bringing that vibe that we miss so much from back in the late 90s you know what i'm saying then we get to track eight this one's called tonight guys not a favorite of mine on the album so i'm saying another hot song right here so i'm saying guys i love the beat on this and the only thing i say about this one right here though guys i wished little wayne was on it so i'm saying because when i listen to the song it's such fun such a joy to hear them together i just wish that wayne was actually on this song guys but it's still hot i love it man so i'm saying salute to them on this song one of my favorites on the album so i'm saying guys it's called tonight as i said man for some reason when i listen to this song it's like i can hear wayne in my head as if wayne should have been on this song with them but maybe next time so i'm saying guys then we get to track nine track nine is called from the bottom so i'm saying guys this one right here not a hot track on this they spit some crazy bars on this so i'm saying guys and this one definitely one of my favorites on the album and definitely going to be a headliner so i'm saying guys this one right here a real banger so i'm saying guys they going real crazy on this then we get to track 10 track 10 is called one two so i'm saying guys another hot track right here this one straight up hood track right here you know they give you that old new orleans street hood style so i'm saying they go real nice on this i love the way they flow on that one so i'm saying guys and i definitely had that one on repeat a couple of times so i'm saying then we get to track 11 track 11 is called today guys Got a hot song on the album right here so i'm saying guys the young kid called nle chopper so i'm saying guys i could hear a younger voice on the song and i don't know if it's him but at the end of the day he's the only person featured on the album so i would assume that he was on piece of that song right here as well so i'm saying then we get to the final song on the album guys which is track 12 this one one of my favorite and definitely a headliner on the album so i'm saying this one's called dreams featuring officially nle chopper so i'm saying guys salute to nle chopper so i'm saying guys a young kid he's featured on the album and he just brings that new school flavor so that these young kids can relate so i'm saying while they get used to hearing Jovi's voice and get to really know the man who pioneered the entire hip-hop they're living off of now and because at the end of the day these young kids they don't really know where these stars started as far as they know Lil Wayne is probably the only person they can go as far back to not knowing that Juvenile was actually the one who came out first and was really headlining and then Wayne came in after and just really started going off so I'm saying what the first set of cash money music that we remember seeing back in the 90s was really juvenile coming up with ha huh, and back that thing up so i'm saying the real big hits and then wayne eventually just came in like a tidal wave and just blew everything away so i'm saying guys but at the end of the day juvie was a real first cash money member that i remember really blowing up big and then as we get used to the rest of the guys wayne just came in and just claimed this rightful place in history so i'm saying so right there guys the song called dreams once again featuring nle chopper so i'm saying salute to nle chopper young kid featured on the album just to make sure that the young kids that are listening can actually relate to the album itself so i'm saying and overall it's a banging project guys it's a must have if you're a true cash money fan and if you are from the 90s era so i'm saying if you can remember where the cash money guys were really appearing on the scene and you can remember when hard dropped and back that thing up it was really in the late nights like 98 99 so i'm saying 
and I can tell you guys straight up man it was a fun time for hip hop it was a turning point we could see a new trend coming in and I enjoyed it so I'm saying guys and it is what it is now these guys are legendary I am happy to see them make amends from their differences so I'm saying guys they've been away from each other for a long time everyone's making up Birdman and everybody else is growing up guys and at the end of the day when you get older you get wiser you try to make amends with all the disputes you might have with close friends that you started out with and at the end of the day as you grow older you're going to need them more and more so i'm saying guys those good friends are hard to find and it's nice when you have the guys you grew up with around you versus having the new people who are just literally fake just to be around you because of the fact that you're famous so i'm saying so i'm happy to see them back together i'm proud of them once again salute to birdman birdman you are an inspiration for me my brother and i know you don't see yourself as a rapper but trust me every time you spit man it inspires me right here dj pablo to really hustle and get money so i'm saying so you're an inspiration to me my brother with your words so i'm saying so i i get excited when you drop any music whatsoever because i know what you're going to be about you're going to keep talking about money and i love hearing it so i'm saying so with that said guys i want you to do the usual the link's going to be down in the description go click the link or check the album more for yourself make sure you cop that so i'm saying guys the people who are true cash money fans you know the procedure you should be scrambling to get that already so i'm saying for the djs djs you know the procedure as well this should have been in your serato and tractor already make sure you start spinning some of the songs off the album so i'm saying especially broke i think broke's gonna go real crazy it's gonna be a major major song for them so i want the djs to really go start pushing that one right now as well as the title tracks just to let people know that they're back to them saying guys and with that said man i'm gonna wrap it up the usual way but once again before i go for the people who are watching for the first time make sure and take the time to look for the subscribe button right down here click that button and turn the notification bell on that way you don't miss any of my videos that i'm saying and for the people who didn't see my video from yesterday i did the yellow wolf album so i'm saying guys you want to go probably go check that out as well so i'm saying guys and I'm just gonna wrap it up man i want to thank you guys for the support guys i am happy to be here with you making videos and i will keep it coming so i'm saying even though i don't go full seven days a week anymore because because of the fact that my day job but maybe one day when i can dedicate myself full time to you guys i can just get back to what i'm used to doing but as much as i can guys i'll make sure you have videos here i want to make sure i have all the new stuff and make sure i get stay on top of what's hot in hip-hop just for you guys and just to show my appreciation for your support so i'm saying so with that said guys i'm gonna wrap it up the usual way peace and salute from west palm beach and i'm out of here and i'll see you guys in my next video all right peace